They are currently estimated to be about 4,100 people sleeping rough on the streets of England on any given night. Even though these numbers are likely to be an underestimate, they suggest that rough sleeping has doubled since 2010. So why might this be? One of the answers might be austerity. Since 2010, we've seen a decline in social housing funding. We've seen um, a number of uh, low-income families who are being housed in the private sector. And the result of all of this is that we're seeing a number of families who are being evicted as a result of falling into rent arrears. And with eviction, obviously, the direct fallout outcome of eviction is homelessness. And since 2010, we've seen a massive increase in the numbers of families with children who are being sent to temporary accommodation. Uh, currently, we're seeing approximately 120,000 children who are now living in temporary accommodation. Um, since 2010, we've seen year in, year out, a 14% reduction in uh, homelessness hostels. We've seen a decline in the number of bed spaces that hostels would normally have. We've seen a number of homeless hostels closing. So where normally homeless individuals would be using and accessing those hostels, what's happening is now they're no longer entitled or they can't access those hostels because they no longer exist. We've seen a massive shift of people using hostels to people sleeping rough. So we're seeing a heightened visibility of people sleeping rough since 2010. Get more from the Open University. Check out the links on screen now.